Hey guys, it's Andy again, back with another video for Call of Duty Modern Warfare. So if you're new to my channel, I do gameplay tutorials and also product reviews. If you like what you see, comment down below and don't forget to subscribe. So today in this video, I'm going to end up showing you how to get the Operator Golem. So as far as the perks, I suggest that you use Overkill. That way you're able to use two primary weapons. As for one of them, I suggest you use the riot shield because it builds a good defense and at the same time you could hide behind it when you're getting shot at. And as far as the roll, I suggest you use medic, that way you're able to heal your teammates when they get knocked out. So the mission that you have to complete is called Kuvaldo. So as you can see by my loadout, I got the heat cycle SMG and also the riot shield. That way I have defense. So now I'm gonna end up showing you the route that I take. That way I'm able to do the first part really fast. Honestly, this part, sometimes I do crash into that tree, but sometimes I just swoop by like nothing. And boom. <laughs> My car blew up. So now at this point, you want to go inside this building, just make sure everything is clear, then hit up this computer. So now at this point, all you have to do is wait until the data transfers, but just be careful because there is a juggernaut in the area. So at this point, I usually just play tag with the Juggernaut and just run around the building while I just wait for the data to transfer. So once it's done, it gives you three different locations for you to go to. So these locations have three different crates that you need to place beacons on. So this clip is just to show you the extra place that pops up so you can end up putting the beacons on the crates. So once you get to the location, go to the computer and log in. Search for manifest, then search, then get off the computer. Let it do the rest. So once it's done, it'll give you the tag number for the crate that you need to find. Then all you have to do is just search around and look for the crate. So just a tip, for every single mission, they're never going to be in the same place. So this is the mission I was able to help my brother obtain Golem as the operator. So the location I'm at is the warehouse. All you have to do is search around for the crates and place the beacons on the crates. So once you finish off one location, all you have to do is move on to the next, then the next. So at the moment, I'm just logging into the computer at the storage and going to manifest and getting everything ready. Then moving on to the next location, that way my teammates are able to help. So now I'm at the barracks and the good thing is one of my teammates already got onto the computer and already had everything set up. Now just looking around for the crates. So one of the good things, even though I got knocked down, I didn't give up trying to search the crates. So luckily I was able to find it. That way once my teammate healed me, I ended up getting it right away. Crates. 
So now that the barracks are done, now the final thing to do is hit up the storage. So since I had everything set up, all I had to do is just place the beacons and I was good. So once you finish all three locations, all you have to do is just head for the hangar now. So before you're able to go inside the hangar, you have to go into this building and open the door. So the button that you need to press to open the door is upstairs. And this is the button to open the door. So now you have to go inside and place a beacon on the ballistic missile. So the ballistic missile is on the right side, but I wanted to heal my teammate first. And those are the ballistic missiles that you need to mark. So after you do, you're able to go inside the tanks and escape, and blow up some other tanks too. I honestly think this is the best part of this mission. Well, I gotta say, it was a lot of fun blowing up this tank. But don't be like Andy and get your tank blown up. So the messed up part is my teammate didn't want to let me inside the tank. Now I gotta book it. So the final piece of this mission is to actually head to the marker that says exit. So the only thing that you have to make sure is that you're alive when you get there. So I just wanted to leave that piece in because that's happened to me so many times when I've been trying to finish this. So this is actually the final piece. All you have to do is run over there and get inside the helicopter that's waiting. So I really hope this video helped you out with some tips and at the same time became useful so you could finish this mission a lot easier and faster. So now you just have to hop in and you're done.
And with that, that ends this video. I hope you enjoyed. Like and subscribe. And don't forget to comment down below if you like what you see.